Yeah, well, adjustability really or showcasing the different lengths. Oh. You can see there it's 18 to 21. We have those three different colors. Reversible though, that is so unique and so original and so inventive. And I love that we could bring that to you because, well, we, for that value, you get both necklaces. You have two necklaces and yep. one. Oh my gosh, it, is, it really is beautiful. All right, we gotta move on. We got a lot to get to, my goodness. All right, <gasps> let's talk about this Byzantine necklace. All yes. right, now, in the Byzantine necklace, the good news is, is I have two links. The bad news is, we don't have a lot of these. I'm gonna actually move one off because you have to almost appreciate this for just how amazing it really is. In fact, let me slide this off. And don't forget, if you're a Byzantine girl, we've got Look imagine. at those together. Look, look at That's that. a perfect suite to put oh together for gosh. you. It's so rich. I mean, the woman, you, who's going to be wearing it. I mean, get to put this on and go places. I wanna know more about you. I feel like what life you lead, you know, she's gonna, it's such a rich, rich design that we have, a rich chain that is just an aspirational necklace that you have. Yes, it is. The Byzantine of all the necklaces is the one that everybody desires. You know, it really is a stunning, stunning piece. Now, this is really interesting because it graduates. And I, I, are you wearing that vowel a little high up on your neck? Can you pull it all the way down? There we go. Because I don't want you guys to mis be misled because it's not a choker at all. Um, so here's what we have. We have two links. We actually have the 17-inch or the 18-inch. That's pretty impressive. Yeah, that is. Uh, both the same price, which obviously it's more silver and it's a lot more gold when you're working with one more inch. Lobster claw clasp on the back, and it gradually goes from a smaller base in the back to this really big voluptuous front that has um, the true Byzantine design, which the Byzantine, when it comes to chain, is one of, if not the most complicated chain to actually make. Absolutely, I mean, it's interwoven together. I mean, the craftsmanship that, that you have within this piece that's made just for you, I mean, that it, that all, how the, it's intertwined and woven together, it's very complex. And I said, royalty has worn this through the ages. And now, well, you could be the queen and have one for yourself. You deserve it. And you know what? If you think about royalty, the Byzantine Empire, I mean, that's where yes. it's, it's basically from is the Byzantine Empire where royalty only wore this. And you know what? If you actually look at old movies and they're really doing authentic, um, like, work on that costumes, right. costuming, you'll see the Byzantine link. You see it show up if it's royalty or an emperor or somebody like that because that's who wore it. That's who could afford it. Yes. Uh, and very, again, very complicated link, but truly the epitome of... Uh, what I call a rich girl piece. You know, if you see I mean, a woman wearing a gold it. Byzantine, oh, you're just like, oh man, I really would love that necklace. And again, even if this was solid gold, it'd be thousands of dollars. But because it's Technobond, because it has that very unique characteristic of all precious metal finished in 18 karat gold, then you're getting the best of both worlds. Who cares what's on the inside? when the outside's gold. No one yeah. knows it's silver, but the nice part about it is it's not base metal on the inside. That really is the difference. And you get to be proud of this price. Obviously, you're proud wearing it, but I'm the woman that's <laughs> like, do you know how much I got this for, though? But I always say there's two different women. There's women that are like, oh, I, I spent this amount, and yes. I'm like, no, wait, do you hear what I spent? Like, I want to tell you right. about my deal, but you have 18 karat gold against your skin. You have this complex, complicated chain that's here. This is a piece that you would see behind a glass you know, case but sure. with those those big doors that are so heavy. It's 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 like a boutique high end designer look that you have here. Like I said, it's it's an aspirational piece that you can really feel like royalty, like you are an empress, and you're wearing this. But you could see how complex. I know when Suzanne was holding it, you could just see it against your how mm. much of it. it's weighty. It's a legitimate amount, but it's really substantial, complicated, and and just stunning and, and rich in, in what it looks and, like. And I mean, we're talking about low loads of uh, gram weight in terms of precious metal. And, and when you're wearing it too, you really will get a real true sense of pride. I mean, owning a Byzantine is a status symbol. Let's just be honest about it. You know, if you have a Byzantine necklace, it truly is a status symbol in the world of jewelry. Everyone knows it when you see a woman in a Byzantine, and it's always so appropriate. For me, if you are trying to go and make an impression, maybe you're trying to get a raise at work or a different position, or maybe you're making a presentation, yeah. and you want to walk in, or maybe 
maybe you're in real estate, maybe you're in a sales and you want to look really successful, you wear a Byzantine necklace. And again, when you wear gold and you're wearing authentic gold, it's very, very different than wearing costume or wearing fashion pieces because this is the real thing. The only difference is it's silver deep inside. So you're not having to pay for solid gold. And why bother when this will never wear off? This will never wear off. You'll never see it fade. You'll never see the silver underneath it. It's going to look like this for the lifetime of the piece. It really will. And that's what's amazing. It's an investment that you're putting in, but you'll have this a lifetime and could be a piece that you get to hand down to someone else. I totally agree with you, too. And it's funny, when I was first introduced to uh, Tectobomb, which is now our Sevilla collection, um, I thought, once I understood it, I was like, why would anybody buy any solid gold? It, it makes no sense to me anymore because this is such and an affordable alternative. And the pricing right now, it's oh, incredibly, today. incredibly yeah, challenging. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Even it was funny a couple of years ago when silver was 